Okay, I went to CVS on Thursday, on Thanksgiving Day, to do, to take advantage of the sales, um, for Black Friday deals, since I was running a three-day special. It started on Thursday at 7 a.m. Well, that's what, what time my CVS store opened. So anyways, I came into CVS with one dollar in extra care bucks and several manufacturer coupons. So here is my trip that I am about to show you. Um, before that, I I went to C when I went to CVS. I thought the store was closed. There was no one at the store except me and two or three customers and the sales associate so usually it's like that kind of like that probably during the weekdays so yeah i almost thought the store was closed because that there was no cars there barely no one was there so luckily the doors were open and yeah okay so here is my trip my first transaction i got one CarMax Strawberry Chapstick. It was on sale for one dollar and you get back a dollar in extra care box. Okay, and I am going to show you guys my receipt here. I purchased one CarMax Strawberry Chapstick for one dollar and I used a one dollar off um, ECB coupon from my green bag tag use. And my total was free. I paid nothing out of pocket. So it's a big old goose egg. Um, but then I didn't have to pay sales tax or anything because of the extra care buck covered everything. So it was a store special for me. So, so I saved 100% on this trip basically. So I will have one dollar to continue on with my next transaction in extra care box. Okay. And in my second transaction I purchased two Theraflu products. This one's the eight count um, capsule. It was on sale for one eighty seven. And the Theraflu travel size package for one count was on sale for ninety nine cents. Um, my subtotal was <laughs> my subtotal for this was um, I mean uh, I used a manufacturer coupon three dollars off of two, which that had been adjusted to um, two dollars and eighty six cents since CVS does not give overage, um, and I did contacted the Theraflu and see that if it was okay um that if it if they were going to reimburse cvs the same amount for instead of giving giving back three dollars so they said that they will only reimburse them two dollars and eighty six cents okay and um my subtotal was zero dollars it was free so Everything was free. I just had to pay for sales tax here. Here in Charlotte, North Carolina, the sales tax do not cancel out each other. If it's zero dollars, you have to pay the difference on the sales tax. But anyways, I did not, my, me and my cat, well, my cashier knows that I do not like to pay sales tax and yeah, I respect that. So anyways, I got back. $2.86 and I presented the cashier my green bag tag use and I also got back a dollar back in extra care box. So from transaction number one and transaction number two I have $4.86 to continue on with my transaction. Okay, and here is transaction number three. I got one finished Quattrum 10 pack of dishwashing detergent for 
and I had a one dollar off manufacturer coupon, which that brought it down to one ninety nine. And the soft lips, chapstick vanilla scent, the vanilla flavor was on sale for two dollars. And I use uh, I use the manufacturer coupon, which that deducted one dollar. And I also use a a one ninety nine in extra care box and a dollar and eighty seven in extra care box. And my subtotal was thirteen cents and I paid forty nine cents. And I got back four dollars and ninety nine cents in extra care box to continue on with my next transaction. And here is transaction number four. I purchased one Starbucks double shot coffee drink for one sixty nine. One Kleenex cool touch tissue for one dollar and fifty cents. Snickers um, peanut butter for seventy five cents and M and M's pretzels candy. Candy bag for 75 cents, and I got a caramel for 33 cents just to cover the cost of my extra care box. And here is my receipt. Here, as you can see, I handed the cashier four dollars and 99 cents in extra care box. So my subtotal, I mean, my total out of pocket would have been five dollars and two cents. But after that, I only paid, my subtotal was three cents. So my total out of pocket was 27 cents. And then I got back $4.69 in an extra care box to continue on with my next transaction. And here is transaction number five. I got two of the Listerine packs. One is the Fresh Burst and the other one is the Arctic Berry. They are on sale for two ninety nine and that would equal to five dollars and ninety eight cents. And I use two dollar two fifty cents off manufactured coupons, which that deducted to four dollars and ninety eight cents. And I also handed them my four dollars and sixty nine cents from from transaction number four. And I paid 29 cents, my subtotal was 29 cents, and my total out of pocket was 72 cents. But then I got back $5.98 to continue on with my next transaction. Okay, here is transaction number six. Right? I got one bit of fiber for, it was a three count pack for one dollar and forty nine cents and I had a two dollar off of one manufacturer coupon which that had been adjusted to one dollar and forty nine cents. So out of this transaction I only paid eleven cents out of pocket. So this this was free. Totally free just how to pay sales tax. Again the sales tax you have to pay here in North Carolina. You have to pay. But then I got back $1.49 to continue on with my next transaction. Okay, here is transaction number seven. Right? I got one brief right. It was on sale for $5.99. Used a $1.50 off, manufa $1 off manufactured coupon. Which that became, I think, four forty nine, and also I got the sheets energy strip stripes, berry blast. It was on sale for three ninety nine, and just to give you guys a heads up, I tried it. It did not taste really good. It is not good. So it has it tastes like medicine and. It was just too strong for me. But, I mean, I guess you just gotta get used with it. So anyways, I handed the cashier lots of extra care box. I don't even know how much it was from my previous transaction. I guess, 
want to say eight dollars and so it's like eight dollars and forty eight cents I believe but then I paid my subtotal was one cent and my total out of pocket was sixty six cents but then I got back nine dollars and eighty eight cents to continue on with my transaction okay here is transaction number eight the last and final transaction I did this yesterday okay so and the sale was still going on so yeah it was a good thing so I got one cinnamon toast crunch it was on sale for 287 and I got two of the planters honey peanut roasted for six dollars and two of the Hershey's candy drops for 198 which was like 99 cents each okay and here is my receipt here as you can see I use a 75 cent off coupon for the, from the Cinnamon Toast Crunch which that brought it down to $2.12 and then I handed the cashier $9.98. My subtotal for this transaction was $0.12 cents, and after ta sales tax and everything was $0.76. Cents. And my and I also got back six dollars and ninety eight cents an extra care box to continue on with my transaction so I will keep rolling them okay and I just want to say that you know I would have paid about fifty dollars if I did not have any coupons or anything like this or it would have been like you know it would been really expensive so um well I mean if I didn't have any coupons it would have been a lot of money so I spent out of pocket probably about three dollars and that is probably because of sales tax and everything all the stuff here was free it was money makers and everything it was great so yeah Okay, what well, that's about it.